How's it going, Fluke fans? This is Ken coming at you. This trip you're seeing now is Wednesday, June 3rd, with Anthony Goo on board, Mr. Fish and Lifts on YouTube. And uh, we were targeting Fluke out of Greenport, New York, Peconic Bay. And uh, it was very, very slow. It has been very, very slow. Um, for those who don't know, the North Fork, Conic Bay, Eastern Long Island fabled for some great trophy fluke action in the springtime. Um, okay, some people say there are good years and bad years, but uh, for me personally, I've been fishing here regularly since 2008. It's been 12 years. And this is the slowest, toughest fluke fishing I've personally seen with my own eyes yet. Uh, very little action, not even a lot of shorts for the most part, much less keepers or trophy size specimens. It's been really hard. So um, for that reason, I'm combining two trips in this video. This trip is Wednesday, June 3rd, 2020. And uh, I'm going to show you uh, Friday, June 5th, 2020, with uh, Gilberto Diaz Jr., Mr. Pier Fishing New York. Uh, so, without further ado, here we are into the action. We're drifting out in front of Greenport. And um, where we've done a couple uh, micro drifts just checking a couple spots in this area and uh, now what you're seeing here is uh, I, I've really set up on my first serious drift uh, that I I have kind of some kind of confidence in I've caught nice fish here before and I'm hoping to catch one right now Alright, so to bring you all up to speed, what I'm doing is I'm uh, using a traditional jig rig. I've got a, I think it's a 4 ounce backwater baits bucktail on the bottom. I have a 6 inch gulp grub on there. And uh, I tipped it with a strip of squid. Uh, above, I have a geezer's teaser again with a four inch uh, swimming mullet in chartreuse and I tipped it with a spearing. Normally I would have tremendous confidence in the gulp alone but the fishing has been so difficult and devoid of action that uh, I've resorted to bait I'd to get bites. We're off to a good start today on the geezer's teaser Uh, four inch chartreuse gulp. I gotta get my hook out. Teaser's teaser with the chartreuse scope. Oh, it's a lean. Yeah, 
a squirrel hake. In the wing family. They taste good and they make good bait. This is just awesome. So this trip, I actually had the most fluke uh, since I started fluking this year on May the 7th. And uh, probably combined, Anthony and I had maybe 18 or 19 undersized fluke all day, only the one keeper. Uh, there's been life in the bay, there's been a super abundance of sea robins. The last week and a half, we've been inundated with uh, cocktail bay bluefish. Uh, there's the odd porgy around that will hit the, uh, the fluke jigs and so on, and the fluke baits. Um, but just not enough quality fluke. It's been really, really tough. And uh, you'll see a little montage of uh, throwback fluke and then we're going to segue into the next trip Friday uh, June 5th 2020 with Gilberto coming right up and by the way the outfit that I'm using is uh, one of my beloved uh, M3 tackle spoon rods and I've got that paired up with a Quantum Accurist and spooled up with 10 pound test suffix 832 in the lime green. How you doing? Don't go buying anything. Uh, yeah, from the. Uh, oh, let's see the steering wheels. Uh, I went to one last week. It was huge. This one's small. We haven't caught a fluke yet, but you might be our good luck charm right now. Oh, you're out with uh, Gil? Yep. Oh, nice. Well, tell him to check the stocks, Ooh. man. It's a good day. Check your stocks. It's a good day. I think I got a fluke, dude. Nice. All right, let me let you go. I'll, I'll, I'll find that uh, steering wheel thing, okay? Oh yeah! Woo! Oh yeah! Woo! Oh yeah! Oh yeah! Is that right. seven plus? Yo, looks That's like a it's more than that, right? It's at least seven, I'm thinking. Oh. I had him double hooked. Nice, <laughs> nice, Kenny. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> wow. You were running too. Yep. <laughs> Very nice. Oh, yeah, I got so this That's is the, the first, first one. Ever today. He's <laughs> even bleeding himself out. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Very nice. Woo, baby! Did you mark that? Yeah. Well, I got the drift line. All right. That's
got another one going back. Oh, he just coughed up like a baby wing. Yeah. N W Custom Bucky Silver Bowl. <laughs> yeah, baby. So that's a wrap, folks. Other than that, had one more short fluke to throw back and uh, called it a day. It was uh, long, it was slow, the action was uh, not fast and furious by any means. And that's been the average trip for me since may 7th all spring very very happy to have these two nice fish especially that one just a hair shy of seven pounds uh looking forward to getting back out get at them again everybody stay safe healthy see you soon tight lines